Is Pepe going to go to zero? In this video, let's talk about why I think there are massive reasons and multiple reasons as to why this thing could still potentially pump. Now, for those that aren't in Pepe already and you guys don't want to catch a falling knife, honestly, it might make sense to just stay away from this. But for those investors that want a little bit of hopium, here I am giving you your daily dose. Now, welcome back to the channel. If you guys are interested in Pepe videos, daily Pepe videos, in fact, hit that subscribe button and down below. Now, I don't know why I'm doing this accent, but look, let's talk about it because this thing is down 11.5% on the day in the past week, down 17% in the past month, down 22%. Guys, motherfucking Andrew Tate went to jail and came back and that shit is still pumping harder than this. So what the fuck is going on? Let's take a look, guys. So what I want, one thing I'll say is, you know, shout out to Redford. Um, it's actually his birthday, so uh, Red Frog, if you've ever seen any of these videos, happy birthday to you, my man. Um, we should definitely connect on X, because that'd be cool, and you're cool. But listen, I want to share with you a piece of content that he made, because this, this shit's fire, okay? So this is a thread on the bull case for Pepe on the road from 100 mil to 10 billion. Now, unfortunately, we're at 43 mil, down about 60%, but there might still be a case for Pepe. So we're going to go over it. So the first thing is, obviously, it was massive during its launch, and it's on ETH, right? So it's on Big Daddy ETH, um, which, you know, makes sense. ETH is obviously one of the biggest blockchains out there. Uh, the next thing is China, right? So the whole Chinese narrative, and guys, we've talked about this before. I've already said this before. I'm like, guys, listen, people don't understand what's going to happen. Um, in fact, literally, I tweeted, uh, and you guys should definitely go follow me on Twitter, people don't understand how hard Pepe will pump once China unbans, which is very true, guys. Like, this thing will definitely go a little abrazy. But back to... Um, uh, red frog we can see meme coin super cycle so meme coins are the play of the cycle social tokens that represent a narrative community and meme ability will make past cycles like DeFi summer slash empty slash alt ones or sorry alt layer ones look like blips on the map now the whole idea of a meme super cycle I hope it does happen, right? In, in a perfect world, it happens because I love meme coins, right? They're amazing and they're fun to talk about. They're fun to invest in and lose money in. But I don't know if I'm not 100% sold. I don't know if we're for sure going to have a meme coin super cycle, but let's just say we do. Buddy, come on. This shit's going to go crazy. Now, <clears throat> Next thing is this right here. The dev team has unlocked the meme coin flywheel that speaks to the experience and competency of the builders. Their approach has had them quickly compared to very successful blue chip projects of the past, poised to explosive growth as more mainstream investors on board. And this is the meme coin flywheel. So obviously, number one is awareness, right? <coughs> then community, then availability. And you just keep on doing that over and over and over and over and over and over and over again. And then eventually you ejaculate, right? So pretty cool. Now, one thing I will say next is these centralized exchange listings. There's so many for this. If you actually take a look at Pepe and go to the markets, we can see there's a decent amount, right? We go to Sex, Gate.io, MEXE, Bitmark, LBank, XE.com, CoinX, Hotcoin, BitTrue. Um, a lot of these are, you know, pretty known. <coughs> so the only things we're missing are like the massive ones, you know, like the KuCoins, Kuk Quota.com, Coinbase, Binance, like the big, 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 big ones. So whenever we see those, uh, I don't know, shit will go up, shit will bump, right? Now, Let's go back over here to the story, which, by the way, shout out to Red Frog, because honestly, man, you're just making my YouTube video very easy today. You gave me a lot of content today, so shout out to you, and happy birthday once again. Uh, so we can see there's also been endorsements in the Legends. Honestly, I don't really give a fuck about this one, because, you know, we've had people endorse projects that went to zero before, so this one doesn't really matter, but I just have to show you guys. The holder base is exceptional for Pepe. It is on pace to become the most wildly held meme coin on ETH, with fewer whales and, um, and more passionate community base. Decentralization is bullish for any major project, which is true. Um... We could see holders outside of the top uh, 500 wheels. You know, that is pretty cool. Now, the next thing is content is king, which is facts. Um, one thing, I I'll say this for free, right? I freaking love the Pepe artwork that gets tweeted. It just makes my thumbnails so freaking easy. I post them, and boom, it's super easy, right? Now, also, follow everyone to see what they're up to. And obviously, follow your boy on Twitter as well. Uh, and, you know, holler at me on Telegram, whatever that may be. Now, also, guys, um, <clears throat> it currently has over 40,000 holders, which is super cool to see as well. So this thing is definitely going to go crazy. If you actually take a look at the contract, we can see we are at, yeah, literally over 40,000 holders and 737. That is massive. Now, guys, one thing I will say as well is the only other project that I would be looking at right now, if you're a Pepe investor or want to go through the whole frog meme coin ecosystem, is the Pepe Unchained, right? This is the Pepe blockchain. So... This thing has raised over $11.5 million. It has instant bridging between ETH and the Pepe chain. I'm going to make a whole dedicated video about the Pepe blockchain literally uh, in a couple hours. So stick uh, to this channel, hit the subscribe button with the notification bell, and watch out for that video. So you're going to come out in a couple hours. Uh, so make sure you check that one out because you're going to really understand where you can make some massive gains with a pre-sale project, right? Some insane gains to be made. We're talking anywhere from 10 to 50x off a rip. Okay, so let's take a look at that in the later video. I'll see you guys later. Take care and goodbye.